Peace. This is a Meat and Potatoes Sorcery production story on myself, the Water Alchemist. And today's topic for the occult family is ascending the Akashic Records. Now, as we know, the Akashic Records hold all forms of one's past, present, and even future, irrespective of civilization. But there's another form of the Akashic Records, and that's the quantum fields. And the quantum fields is pure consciousness. In other words, it even goes beyond so-called good and so-called evil. Now, the middle ground or so-called tier is accountability. So there is no escaping that when you go to the quantum fields. Now, what are the things that keep a person tied to the third dimensional reality and the worst case scenario of doing this all over again. You. You keep yourself tied through the ego because remember, the ego, one aspect of it is to protect you, but the other aspect is to sabotage transformation. And you can't have transformation without taking responsibility for your role in anything. So your ego is the one attribute psychologically that keeps you tied to this reality. And let's see how it keeps you tied here. I can tell you that there's this so-called master race. And you feel like that all your problems would be resolved if another race was not here. Well, if that's the case, then... What was World War I? That was European versus European. Check your records. You had United States, Germany, and Russia. Or let's go even further and talk about the formation of the Zulu Kingdom. You want to know how that really began? That began over a fight over a woman between two brothers, Kwabe and Zulu. So I'm saying this to say that even if you got rid of a particular race, you still would have some of your problems. That will keep you tied here. Another thing that will keep you tied here is your fanatical approach to politics. What is the matrix? The matrix is illusion. The master race, ego, illusion. Politics, illusion that this particular party is going to create this utopian society. When both parties are on the payroll and are at the behest and the beck and call of corporations. So it doesn't matter. So what are you arguing about? Democrat, left, right, Republican, just like you're seeing in the news now that the Republicans are looking like the good guys. This is pro wrestling, third dimensional reality style. So right now in wrestling, you have the Republican, which is the baby face and the Democratic Party, which is the heel. This is what you have. So I'm not saying you can't have an attachment, but when you put things in, the, it's either good or evil. It's either left or right. When you do that, it's very hard to ascend the Akashic Records, let alone the quantum fields, and get the things that you need. Because you have to have not only accountability, you can't be overly attached and have this investment. We've seen this also with religion, whether it be Catholicism, which birthed all forms of Christendom, or Al-Islam. When Al-Islam, when you think about it, that was a mystical religion at one time. And it well supersedes the Sufis. Just like Allah was a moon deity. So you can't get all caught up in that. And the number one thing, and I want to say about this, when you're dealing with the Akashic Records, take responsibility in your role when it comes to the failure of your marriage or the breakdown of your family or even dealing with your mother or your father. What role did you play? Maybe they are more at fault. And this doesn't matter if you're adopted or biological. 
because you can be adopted and still take on someone's karma. Did you know that? You can take all their things. And why do you do this? Because everything is energy. So you can take this on by your willingness to be here, but you don't know when to pull back and let a person learn from their own mistakes and their misdeeds. That's true elevation. That is true consciousness. When you don't beat yourself up, but you take responsibility and then you forgive yourself and then you can ascend. That is how you do it. But you don't do anybody no service by once again falling into the trap of the ego. Oh, I'll just do it because see, I know if I do it, it'll be done right. Or, well, they can't do nothing without me. See, that's your ego. How are they ever going to learn how to stand on their own too when you always getting your metaphysical cape out of the cleaners and coming down in the role of Kal-El, also known as Superman? No. You should have a whole bunch of Clark Kent moments. And that's not just for you, but that's for them too. So, how do you ascend with the Akashic Records? Accountability, one. Two, Removing guilt. Three, learning to really love yourself and not being on social media and going through a moment of loving yourself. That's how you ascend to the Akashic Records and then the quantum fields. That is how you do that. Period. Point blank. So, with that, that is your meat and potato sorcery for the day. I am the White Alchemist. Be water, my friends. Peace.